What is up, YouTube? We are back here yet again with an, another tutorial in DaVinci Resolve, and today we are going over the low pass filter, or commonly known as the underwater or muffled sound effect that you can put over your audio. So for those of you who have been in Premiere Pro, and I'm not sure how Final Cut Pro is, but you could just drag and drop a low pass filter on your audio and it would instantly, just like that, muffle it. In DaVinci, we do not have that luxury of just dragging and dropping a filter over it, but I figured out how you can do this within the Fairlight tab and make it sound phenomenal, and it actually is pretty easy. So let's just get into DaVinci and let's get this low pass filter going. All right guys, so now that we are back here in DaVinci Resolve again, as you can see, I have an audio track, just some music that I have downloaded from Epidemic Sound. Um, if you haven't checked out Epidemic Sound, make sure you guys uh, check them out. I'll put their links in the description below. They are the best website to find like music that you can license for your clients and for your YouTube videos and for any project you have. Plus, they have dope sound effects which make doing sound design like such a breeze and like it allows you to be so much more creative, but we'll get into all that later. Uh, check them out, their link will be in the description, Epidemic Sound. They don't give me nothing to say that, they're just super dope. Like, check them out. But anyways, we got this uh, song in here, it sounds like this. So it's pretty loud and we want to muffle it. And to do that, you're gonna come down here to the Fairlight tab. All right guys, so now that we are here in the Fairlight tab, you can see we got our effects over here on the left, we got our mixer over here on the right, and right in the middle, we have our audio track. And the only thing we need to do to make this effect happen is come over here on the right under audio track one or whatever track that your audio that you want muffled is on. For us, it's audio track one right now, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit the EQ and it's your equalizer. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your number five right here, we're gonna bring it down to one line above negative 20 and we're gonna bring it over here in the middle to 1K. So it should be one line above negative 20 and it should be right on the 1K line. And what we're gonna do now on the left side is grab the two and do the exact opposite. We're gonna come up and hit the 500 it should be 500 and it should be one line below plus 20. And that is literally all you have to do for this effect. And I'll show you guys the, the after of it. And it sounds muffled. So if you come back to our edit page and we put a cut right here and we drag it below. So now this audio will be muffled and this audio will be normal. And this is what it'll sound like. All right guys, so that is how you do a low pass filter or the underwater muffled sound effect in DaVinci. And I just wanna thank everybody who has been following along recently and thank everybody for the comments and the questions and all the love you guys are giving me recently. I really appreciate y'all and um, I'm pumped to keep coming up with more content. I'm getting a lot of different requests and I promise you guys that those videos are still coming. I have a tutorial coming out for my most favorite gimbal moves and I have a glitch transition tutorial coming out. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna go over a bunch of other stuff in the future here. So just make sure you guys are uh, subscribing so you guys can follow along and you know learn as we learn together and grow together in DaVinci. And make sure you guys are smashing that thumbs up button. It helps me a lot and I appreciate y'all for doing that. And make sure you guys throw any comments below if you have uh, any questions about any, how to do anything within DaVinci or have anything to add that can benefit anybody um, on these tutorials. So thank y'all for watching. I'm gonna catch you in the next one.